Dear students, welcome to our third part. Now we'll create, as we mentioned, front view sections of our parts. Let's go to our parts. Here is our parts. As we can see, we have cap, we have body. We already have a section in our bush here front view section of our bush so we'll do a section in this part to do a section I'll make a copy of our frame and put it here I'll take our cap I'll copy it so I'll go to copy here copy ah oh, before we copying I don't think we need these dimensions and these annotations now so we can go to our layers here make these off but how can we know on what layer are these dimensions so we'll click here and open that layer I have something stuck here I click here and go to layer on layers and we can see that these layers are on dimension these dimension are on the dimension layer this annotation will open and see that this is on symbol layer so these two layers I'll make them off freeze and lock this is our symbol layer, so I'll make it off as we can see they are out of our freeze and lock I'll go to dimension layer here's dimension layer and make it off in order to get rid of these freeze and lock I need only my drawing I'll take this part as I told you copy I'll take this part only enter click and move it to here in order to be more obvious so we'll make front view section where is my section line my section line will be from here I'll make my object snap on and I'll take it from the midpoint to this midpoint so this is my sectional plane as we see our all the body will be sectioned our holes will be sectioned and this hole also will be sectioned in sectioning as we know we'll change our hidden parts to continuous because we can see them already so I'll take this hole and take this hole and change them to continuous by changing the layer to AM0 they are visible now and I'll add hatch 45 degrees I'll put it here enter here enter here so I change my front view into sectional front view of my part when I finish I'll hit save first then I'll select this part right click go to clipboard and make a copy this copy I'll put it where in my new template that I did I right click here clipboard paste we'll go back to our detail drawing and we'll work with our body so I'll make a copy of my body 
copy. I'll put it in another drawing here. It's also obvious that my section will be from the mid to mid and all the components of the body will be cutted so all the hidden line this is a rectangle down here it's cut so it will be visible so I'll change it to visible lines my holes are cut too so I'll take this one and this one and change them to visible lines on the layer AM0 second thing I'll do in the in this body we have here the outside line that separates the base of the body and the top part so I'll trim between these two fillets enter and I'll take this outline because I cut at the middle so any lines between two components of the body will be omitted it will be one material as we see now I can put my hatch as we mentioned in previous lessons I'll, I'll take the opposite direction of the hatch we took this one for the cap and this one will take it for the body and I'll apply enter I'll apply it here enter I'll apply it here enter here, enter, here. So this is my section. As we can see, our hatch line are very dense, so we can a little bit make a spacing more bigger. I'll take five, click OK. It will be here, enter and this is the five size of the spacing in order to to make these hatches the same as this one i'll use the match properties match properties bottom change the spacing of the of these ones to five escape This is my body is ready to take it there to the assemble, assembly sheet. I'll select it, right click to the clipboard or simply hit control with C and I'll go to my here and hit control V. Here's my second part. The third part that we need is our bush. We already have our bush section, so we don't need to do anything here. We just keep take it and put it there. So I'll select all of these ones. Control C or clipboard copy. I'll go to my assembly sheet, right click, clipboard, and paste. Like this, we are prepared our sections. We'll end this lesson and we'll meet in next lesson in order to do creating new component parts. Goodbye for now.